Hello everyone, today I'm gonna show you an animation tutorial about how to animate faster, easier and also some animation tips and some animation life hacks. So let's go. And first thing, you can join our Discord server, there you can find a lot of features and assets. Also you can ask for help, for example, or just show your works. So let's begin the tutorial. So first life hack. I use BPS version 4 rig and to animate it faster, let's say, just go into pose mode, select the head and in bone properties disable your inherit rotation. By default it's enabled but you should disable. So you, you will be able to animate it easier, let's say, because the head will be like independent or something. Second life hack is something what I use every time when I animate uh, my scenes. It's just pr uh, select the material of your rig, press N, go into item, and in properties disable eyebrows, eyes and mouth. So you, you will be able to animate easier your basic poses because you won't have to, to care about uh, face uh, bones. You just can press A, then press I to put the keyframe. Third life hack is about how to animate your, uh, not your, the hands of your rig faster. Just go into pose mode and select the rotation mode. Then in transform pivot, uh, pivot point, uh, select the individual origins. Now you can just select the two bones of your head and left click and drag. As you can see you can animate the both in the same time. If uh, you don't really like the pose of uh, this bone you just can select it and uh, rotate as you want. Next life hack is about uh, pose libraries. I will leave a link in, des in description about how wood plant makes them. Uh, it means when you go into pose mode in animation press N, go in animation and you can make your own pose library for example let's press A and apply this one so let's talk about animation tips and first thing is uh, something what uh, every beginners make this is a mistake I also made it so don't worry the mistake is about uh, they animate only a few bones on their character that's not really correct because your animation will look like a robot, robotic one or I don't know. So you should begin from this one to animate before this one, then this one. Usually I just rotate it anyway. And uh, only then you can, you can animate the hands for example. Uh, this bone I don't really use for male characters. If you can use it, it's really good, but I can't use it yet. Usually I use it only for female characters because it's like, you know, like something elegant. Anyway, let's move next. Now let's talk about fashion animation, uh, animations and uh, let's begin from the eyes. To move eyes, for example, I press I and uh, go to 1, 2, 3, 4 and just move it a little bit. For example, and then go into f the frame 11 or anyway, it doesn't matter. Also, go from here to 1, 2, 3, 4 and move. So the interval between the moving of the eyes should be like uh, 1 to 3, 4 or 1 to 3. It depends also of what you want to make, but usually it's this. Now let's talk about eyes clipping. You select this bone right here, go into uh, to the frame you want, press I, and it's almost the same. It's it's really the same principle as for the eyes. Just go one, two, three, four, 
press G and move it down again one two three four alt G and you have a clipping animation also it it also depends of uh, what you want to make but usually it's this interval between them be between the uh, keyframes now let's talk about uh, some poses mistakes as I said every beginner animate only a few bones of them I also did so don't worry that's not right and it looks like robotic as you can see so let's take a look for the correct one this pose is more interesting than this and uh, you could say what's the difference the difference is uh, I don't know what's the difference anyway it's about uh, lines of actions it means when you can uh, make a line like this as you can see you can find uh, in Google or in YouTube some tutorials about that I can't really explain what's that and uh, let's make a line for this one as you can see it's just uh, uh, just a line it's not a curve like there like it was there and uh, how to how to make a pose like uh, like this one so I will show you let's go into pose mode press A alter alt G and uh, as I said before you need to move the pelvis bone if I don't yes uh, just move it a little bit down and rotate then move the legs you can move uh, this leg like something like that in that way then uh, let's move it a little bit also uh, then you rotate this one and uh, only then you can uh, pose to make a pose for uh, hands okay don't forget about the, he the he head also mm, let's rotate it like this and uh, it's done as you can see everything looks correct and uh, more dy dynamic let's say so thank you for watching uh, don't forget to join our discord server and also if you want to support us we have a patreon system and only for one dollar per month you can uh, have access to our secret assets for example to our wendy gorig and uh, there will be more for instance it's only that also you you will have access to watch our animations before the release to watch some some layouts or some animation processes and etc anyway thanks for thanks for watching again and have a good day